Hi guys, welcome to my capstone presentation. My capstone project is focused on researching the digital chunk show of moda operandi and how to apply the digital chunk show model to smaller fashion boutiques in China. To start with, let's go through the background of the digital chunk show in moda operandi. Moda Operandi is an online luxury fashion retailer that allows customers to pre-order products directly from runway show. In the past, the audience of chunk shows was very limited, and it only serves a small group of people. Normally, it serves the VIP clients for fashion brand. The digital chunk show of Moda Operandi gives normal customers more of what they want while allowing Moda Operandi to make increasingly sustainable inventory decisions. The digital chunk show seems like a magical tool for improving performance of fashion boutiques. But is that true? So my sexy question is, does the digital chunk show help to improve revenue growth rate, reduce inventory, and increase customer engagement? After several months of research, I found that the moda operandi with digital chunk show has excellent performance in revenue growth rate and inventory management, but has underperformed in customer engagement. Overall, Digital chunk shows are a great tool for collecting market information, allowing moda operandi to make more accurate buying decisions. The lower discount rate proves that moda operandi has a relatively healthier margin compared to other competitors. Let's see an example of how the digital chunk show can apply to a smaller fashion boutique in China. Founded in 2009, a favor is a successful online fashion boutique in China. The boutique is recommended by British folk and famous for its innovative business model. Speaking of their innovation, a favor allows their customers to communicate directly with their buyers. They use a tremendous amount of photo taken during the fashion week to promote products. A favor also has a lot of videos in the fashion showroom to provide customers with the most updated information of fashion too, which creates a very exclusive experience for their customers. The store promotes products in social media including Weibo, WeChat and Red. Customers could pre-order through WeChat and Taobao too. Obviously, the model of a favor is the primary form of digital chunk show, but the disadvantage of the model is that that's difficult to scale in e-commerce as they separate the shopping function from online presentation. Actually, they have huge amount of fans in social media, but there is not clear guidance to shopping pages. When displaying in social media, customers cannot find shopping links to purchase products. We can see the followers in their Taobao online store are much fewer than social media. The payment methods are inconvenient too. Transactions are all made through WeChat transfer, which is built on the chest between customers and merchants. The disconnection of product display and payment increase the difficulty of achieving sales. If the online chunk show model can be applied, more people will be exposed to the chunk show and increase the convenience of pre-order. For example, fashion boutiques can hold chunk shows on Taobao live streaming and WeChat, and then embed shopping links on the chunk show platform. Normally, the Taobao live streaming could direct customers to the payment process conveniently. Most fashion boutiques do not have the funds to build an independent e-commerce site, just like Moda Operandi. So, it's very important to use the existing platforms to promote sales. 
The advantage of this approach is lower cost than modal operandi but achieves similar effect. After the trunk show, store can make in-season merchandise purchasing plans based on the data and customer interaction during the live streaming trunk show. After the COVID-19, everyone has realized the importance of digital presence. Digital trunk shows are undoubtedly an important tool to replace traditional trunk shows in the post pandemic era. In the future, it will merge with new technologies and we will continue to see more ways of doing digital chunk shows. In addition to studying how to apply digital chunk show on real business, what retailers and brands need to think about is how to use the digital chunk show wisely and prevent brand dilution. After the democratization of chunk shows, whether innovative trunk show can continue to be part of the luxury fashion still remains a question mark.